Hey guys, it's Mixed Media Girl here. Today I'm doing a pour for my girl Jessica. Not only is it her birthday month, but she asked me to do a pour with oranges specifically to promote awareness of a condition she has. It is called RSD or CRPS, which means either re reflex sympathetic dystrophy or chronic regional pain syndrome. And it's just, this is the promoting that awareness month. And she asked me specifically to do a video with oranges. I will put links down in the description so you can research these conditions more. And um, yeah, we're just gonna do a really cool, hopefully orange pour. Okay, so I actually have four different oranges here and then I have a purple that I'm gonna use as kind of my dark contrasting colors. I kind of custom mixed these oranges. One's like a red orange, one's a yellow orange. This is a uh, metallic iridescent orange. <laughs> All of these are Arteza except for the white is Liquitex. So I'm gonna start with just a little white here and I think I'll go kind of light to dark a little bit. So this is the yellow orange and this is that iridescent. This one's a bright orange, my favorite. And then the red orange. And then I'm going to go ahead and use that purple. I was originally going to use black as a contrast, but I thought this purple would go better. I actually really like purple and orange together. Also blue and orange are great. And I'm going to just layer these colors again. And I will be doing a tree ring, my favorite. So I'm actually going to pour a little less haphazardly into my cup over here. And this is a 10 by 10 canvas. So I need somewhere around six, seven ounces of paint. Okay, that should be more than enough. I'm gonna get these cups out of the way and then we'll have some fun. Okay, here we go. And hopefully that purple doesn't take over too much. I did put a lot of orange in here though, so should be good. Ah, drip. All right. I'm going to go in a little bit of a circular fashion here, because why not? Get that paint moved around. I'm definitely happy that I chose that purple to offset this. All right, there we go. Very, 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 very happy with this. It looks a little more yellow in the camera than it does in real life. Hopefully on the close up, you'll be able to see that orange a little more. So I'm gonna let this sit here for a few minutes and then we'll bring it in for that close up. All right, coming in for our close up. I could not be happier with how this came out. I think it's so gorgeous. Definitely a bit of a risky color combination with that purple, but totally worked out. So please check down in the description for those links so you can read up on this condition, learn more about it. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this. I wish it actually looked how it looks in person. It still looks yellow through the camera. It's definitely more orange in person, but anyways. Thanks for watching. I'll see you all next time.